Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Gex. In this installment, we will hopefully be completing Kung Fuville. Or, at least up to the boss. We'll see how it goes. So, let's begin. Where's the next level? Ah, I wanted the temple. Well, we'll get there next time. In we get. Fish bait. Fun fact, none of these levels involve that dragon. Why yes, I'm here to pick up my lunch. Oh, that's racist. Funny as shit, though. It was a different time. Love that moonwalking. Alright, so unfortunately, this level is mostly underwater. And I say unfortunately because I hate every single water enemy in this game. I need to turn it on my TV. There we go. But yeah, they're, they're all just... just awful. Yeah. Surprisingly, I fear them more than Raiden. Yeah. There we go. If this were a plane crash, I Ooh, this is early, but I'll take it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now. Got him. Yes. Perfection. Probably think that hurts. Ow. Flaw. Ooh, can I get a... Mm. Okay, that probably should have taken some health, but... Nah, I'll, I'll, I'll count my wins. Well, that's... That's just adorable. Spring TVs! Hey, look! SNL! Ooh. Do I risk it? Hmm. Wow, you know, every time I've gone through this level, for whatever reason, I never thought to just stand here and whack them. This is much easier and practically risk-free. I'm an idiot! I'll take this. Risk free. Wow, Gex must be like extremely heavy. Cause you know most people. Oh, I don't know. Float. Oh, two in one. Good going, me. Thank you, me. Huh? <laughs> Stupid fish. Uh, let me think. There's something special about this level. I think, uh, this level has the only indestructible enemy in the game, and that is the red squid. Possibly an octopus. Pretty sure it's a squid. Luckily, they don't actually chase you. They just go in a pattern. Ooh, ice dragons. Yeah. Yeah. I want to live. No well, this is rather reminiscent of that one level from, uh, Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles. That's not something you want in a game. It's really not. But it's not nearly as horrible, to be fair. Eh, yeah, easy enough. Ho oh, sneak attack! I win. Still winning. Just like Charlie Sheen. Yeah. Nope, no, no, no. Got him. Sweet. I was pretty sure I was going to lose some health there. Alright. Oh, bull. This is my tail bounce. I call shenanigans. What kind of ink are they using? Heh. <laughs> no gills. Uh, I'm pretty sure this turns green, doesn't it? Does it not? Ooh, yes it does. Yes it does. Stick to the wall. It figures the second I go in. Eh, I wanna live. That's just life, right? Right. Well, hello, little friend. Die. Just die. Alright, does this turn green too? I don't trust it. Not for a second. Eh, I don't feel like waiting. What do we got down here? Alright, more eels. Not bad. I can handle eels. They're not... They're not terrible. A little bit of a nuisance, but not terrible. Yeah, red squid. There he is. And unfortunately, he won't be the last. Er. Oh, that... That was cruel and unusual. 
a little blank spot down there. Can I get... Can I, like... Is there, like, a false wall here or something that I can get through? No? Okay. Kind of struck me as that kind of area, you know? Yeah, avoid the squid. Avoid the squid. Eh, hey, well. I just suck at video games. That's my problem. Alright, where are we going? Oh, down. Okay. Ooh, checkpoint. Nice. Those help me not lose. Yeah. You do your thing, man. You do you. I'll do me. I'll be happy Gilmore. This is no time for the Jaws theme, Gex. Damn. Where do these fish keep coming from? Also, look at their faces. It's like... Creepy. It, it's like semi-anthropomorphized face. It's ape-like and it's really disturbing. Oh, I don't like you. Eh. Eh. No. Careful. Damn. Eh. I need the health. Screw the life. I don't like this level. Remote. Yes. Freedom. Sweet, merciful freedom. And more water. Yay. I wasn't sick of that yet or anything. Alright, so while we wait... How you doing, Buddha? You taste terrible. Haha! -ha! I don't feel like going down there and risking my life for whatever collectible is in there. Yeah, I'm tripping out, man. I'm tripping out! Yeah, here we go. And... Oh, up here. Yes. Safety. More fish! Thank you for waiting in line. So this is kind of a neat little thing. This little pocket right here is completely unaffected. Which is kind of weird because there's no, like, actual door, but... Hey, you know, don't look a gift horse in the Don't look at a gift horse in the mouth. I can speak. Also, I kind of blew my chance there. Eh. There will be others. Eh, keep going, keep going, keep going. Wanna live? Wanna live? I will live. Oh, wow, that was quick. Ooh. This is telling me I can go down there. I think. Sorry, I only cry at weddings. That was entrapment. That is bullshit. Bullshit! Bullshit of the highest degree. Damn you, Crystal Dynamics. Damn you to hell. I don't want to be in the water. Alright, that cost me a little more time. I really, really hate these fish. They're creepy anthropomorphic faces. Ugh. Hey, Buddha. We could just lick Buddha's ass. See, there's a unique there's a unique aspect of this game. You get to lick Buddha's ass. I am tired. Alright, let's get the hell wait, can we? No secret wall? No? Okay. Let's get the hell out of here. I hate fish bait with a passion. I just do. I don't like water levels. Ha, that is wild. Except for Azeric. Azeric is the exception. Those water levels are fucking beautiful. Come on, Jake. It's Chinatown. Let's see. A little over ten minutes. Eh, why not? Yay, temple. Temple of Doom. Oh, that's kind of neat. They animated the doors. Cool. Kind of a smooth animation, too. I'm surprised. Chop Chop. Oh, right. This is the one with the samurai. Everybody was kung fu Beautiful. Uh, Rocket TV. Easy enough to dispatch. And this, and this, and this. They're terrible at turning. There's the samurai. 
And I call bullshit on that one. I was in the middle of a tail whip. Tail whip. Alright, we got fire breath. As long as we don't squander it, we'll be fine. We'll go up here. Anything? No? Okay. Doesn't this look like the kind of thing that should be hurting me? That red bridge? Like, the fire breath doesn't protect you from it or anything. It's just kind of... I don't know. It's red for some reason. Yeah. It's kind of a mixed signal. Well! Surely these are the best and brightest that Rez has to offer. And they just keep going. Just keep going. I'll take that. You suck. I needed that to live! Alright, try to avoid. So this is where all the missing socks go. Oh sweet, another one. Awesome. One for me and one for where do you lead? Oh, that was an actually necessary one. Alright, I'll take it. Checkpoint. Uh how do I There we go. Geronimo! Anything? No? Alright. Good fun. to test everything. Ooh, right, I can't go up there. There's a bunch of really tight corners that'll just throw me down when I uh, try to crawl over them. Alright, one, two, three, go. Dun, 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 dun. Heh. <laughs> okay, there's a thing down here. Sweet! Eh, yeah, that wasn't worth it. Eh, yeah, well, whatever. Always good to check. Eh, there we go. Much easier. With a fatal flaw. Another tight corner up there. See, if you try to crawl around those things up there, those little nudges, those little nubs, you just fall off. Please, I think it's bull, but, you know. Can't change the game now. I was never really sure how to get that one without, you know, dying. Easy enough. Crawl up here. Damn. Well, let's do it. I wanna live, I wanna live, I totally lived! I'll take this. I'm working without a net here. Careful, careful. And nice and easy jumps. Don't get on the bouncy things. Hey! Nice. Mm, not worth it. Okay, if I start down here, it's gonna cost me a little time, but I also don't wanna risk my power up with those uh, spikes up there. Let's do it. I think these should probably should have been in uh, Congo Chaos. Yeah. All right. Oh, was that it? Okay. I thought I totally screwed up there or something. <laughs> I thought there was like more that I didn't really realize, but whatever. I'm speaking gibberish right now. Haha! <laughs> Missed me. Hello, random wagon. I'm not sure how you'd get across this terrain. Well, I guess that's why you haven't moved in a while. Spider -Man, Spider -Man. Epic Spider-Man reference, so, man. This is where all the missing socks go. Uh, okay, press the pants, no star A lone samurai guarded the remote. And now he's on fire and dead. Well, he was on fire. He's now non-existent. Though matter and energy cannot can neither be created nor destroyed, so he lives on. Not not in a literal sense, but in a pointless metaphorical sense. Also science. Eh, yeah, may as well. Oh, why did I come here? Is there anything up here? No? Damn. I'm probably gonna lose some lives for this. Yeah. I wanna live, I wanna live, I wanna live! I want to live. I wasn't even there. Ooh. Eh. Yeah. Live? Okay. Living. Good. Dying. Bad. I survived. Whew. I usually screw that up royal. I'll take it. I'm not going to any more of those. But I'm curious how you get down there. Not curious enough to risk any more lives. Hurt. Skirt. And hurt. Oh. Hello. Oh, that's how you get down there. 
All right. I'll take it. Mystery solved, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, wow, we have three fire power-ups. Nice. Nice. Yeah. Down here. Goodbye, samurai. Hey, that rhymed. I'm proud of me. All right, easy enough. Easy enough. I do kind of like the kung fu theme, to be honest. Like, like I mentioned before, I don't get a whole lot of the references, but I do have a respect for kung fu and uh, martial arts. I learned a little bit myself. Uh, I learned, like, a little bit of a just, like, a little bit of aikido, a little bit of taekwondo, tiny bit of kickboxing, but not a lot. I learned very little of a few things, is my point. It was fun. It was definitely fun. Except Taekwondo. That... I... I felt like I was gonna die when I did Taekwondo. That was just... Wow. I have a newfound respect for anyone that does that, because that takes endurance. That's just crazy. I wanted my power up. Oh, well. Now, Aikido's kind of cool. It's pretty much... Like, I think most martial arts have that, uh, have that principle of using your enemy's uh, force against them. I think Aikido embodies that extremely well. Like, pretty much every move is, okay, you're gonna do something, I'm gonna exert very little effort, and now your arm's broken. Say goodbye to your arms, your legs, everything. Gone. It's pretty neat. There's a video on YouTube of, uh, of a master taking on, I think, five people at once. And at some point, he's just sitting down as they run at him, and he's just flipping them left and right. That is wild. With, like, no effort. It is the craziest thing. Come on, Jake. It's Chinatown. I mean, it was likely choreographed, but, yeah, you know, it's still pretty cool. Um... You know what? It's been a little over 20 minutes... But I feel like doing the boss. You know what? I'm gonna do the boss. Yes. Let's get it on. Hope you guys don't mind long episodes. Toxic Turtle. That's actually not threatening in the slightest. Hello. Gamora, Gamora, something, something, something Japanese. It's like a Robo Gamora. And I, that's just awesome. Take that. This guy has kind of an erratic pattern, but you pretty much just have to pick a spot that you want to hit him, like a spot in. Oh, yeah. If you start doing it out of order, he'll throw you off. I think the best way to do this is to pick a spot on the map where you want to hit him and just avoid his attacks. I prefer hitting him while while I'm up there. Because it's a lot easier to dodge when you're not on the wall. Like, dodging his stuff while you're on the wall is just a pain in the ass. Also, those ships are pretty sweet. Eh? Oh, wow, he's facing the wrong way. That was... <laughs> fail. Alright, you know what? Screw it. I got my attack in. Which way are you going? Big rocket turtle go bye bye. Sweet. Okay, you know what? Screw my rule. I'm just gonna attack him whenever the hell I feel like it. You suck. He's a vicious little one, I'll give him that. You suck, sir. I do not enjoy your company. Teenage mutant rocket turtles. Shooting out tornadoes. Turtle power. Geronimo! Yeah. Alright. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. That was so easily avoidable. Let's try again. Come on, Jake. It's Chinatown. It is Chinatown. Do I think there's some Japanese influence? Everybody was kung fu fighting. You said that like three times, man. It was cool the first time. Alright, wait for him to do his thing. Wait for him to come down. Damn. Alright, well, whatever. 
concealed. I think I should try to only... Well, I was gonna just gonna say, I think I'm gonna try to only get health when I'm down to one. Because this guy takes a surprising number of hits. Alright, down he comes. Down he goes. Let him slide around for a bit and jump. He gets progressively harder to dodge because he gets bigger and bigger. Ooh, just wasted a wasted a health thing. Damn. Damn, damn, damn! Alright, easy dodge. Easy dodge. Oh, I I didn't realize I actually hit him. Okay. I mean he took damage, I'll take it. Though it did throw off my groove. <clears throat> Damn it all. His hitbox is surprisingly difficult to figure out. At least for me it is. Alright, let him bounce, let him bounce. Where he stops, nobody knows. Ah, damn tornadoes. Don't like these. Because they're so inconsistent. Bullshit. Alright. Left and right, left and right. Hey, you, what you gonna do? Hey, you, what you gonna do? Damn it! Damn it, damn it, damn it. This boss I consider the hardest. I mean, Rez is difficult your first time, but this guy... I just don't like this guy. He takes up so much of the screen. Indeed they were, Gex. Indeed. See, look how tiny he is now. See, here he's cute. Then he gets all ferocious and disgusting. And pure evil. Alright, round he goes. Climb up here, jump. Easy enough. See, if I could just keep doing that, that'd be great. That'd be great. Sorry, I was leaning away from the mic for a bit. Hope that wasn't too long. When you get in your zone, you notice nothing. Okay, down he goes. Alright, run back up here. Let him do his thing. Cool. Alright, same deal. If I could just keep this pattern up, I'll have him beat in, like, no time. Come on back. There we go. Another hit for Jeff. Yeah. Did he actually just make a Gamera reference? Epic! And got him. Sweet. Alright, let him land where he pleases. Alright, cool. Okay, so if I hit him before he does the tornadoes... Alright, that's a good policy. Try doing that. Alright. Let him do his thing. Let him do his thing. Get within striking distance. Okay, cool. Oh, we have no more health balls left. Damn. Alright, just keep doing your thing. Yes! Oh god, he's still hurting me, though. Nice! And that is probably the most badass-looking remote since, uh, since the Cemetery World. Awesome. Also, I did not know you could eat the remote. We're learning today. Yes, there is no substitute. Whew! Man, my back hurts. Welcome back to the dome, everybody! Now, you may be wondering, all four TVs have been used, so where is Rez? Allow me to present where Rez's location is. It's pretty cool. Kind of obvious, but cool. That is freaking epic. That blew my mind when I played this on the 3DO, just seeing that. For whatever reason, I didn't see it coming, but... God, it is so cool. All right, well, let's check out his level before we uh, before we leave off. Rezopolis. Cool. Very, very industrial. I like it. 
Alright everybody, with Kung Fuville completed, and with the end of the game just within reach, I'm gonna go ahead and call it an episode for today. Like, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff if you guys enjoyed the video, and as always, I'll see you in the next one. See you then.